In stage 16, you get the servo, and as we've done before, untighten the four retaining screws, take off the top, and then taking the servo cable from the previous stage, placing that into the relevant position, placing that gently on top, and pressing that down. And once you've done that, just carefully place the top back on and just gently just nip them up, you don't have to tighten them because you're going to be taking them off in the later stage okay and then next we're going to be assigning it its ID Now as we've done before, we're going to be assigning it the ID of 21 and as you can see here, we've already assigned it. Just refer to the instructions by pressing the up 21 times and then holding down the test button until all the lights flashing and then it stays on the 21. Okay. Once that's done, press the test button and the servo. should rotate 45 degrees to one side, 45 degrees to the other, and then back to the center. Okay, once you've done that, turn off the test, and then just gently remove the cable. Okay, and then once you've done that, Now, the final part of stage 16, we're going to be fitting that to the rest of the arm assembly. That we did earlier, so gently remove the top. Once again, sliding the cable through the servo mount. And then once you've done that, tighten up the four screws into position like so okay just remember do not over tighten them okay so do that with the remaining two screws and that completes stage 16